Hello traders, this is Rich from TradeSite. This is a look at our market leading stocks via our proprietary scans for the coming session. This is going to be for Tuesday, September 17th, 2013. Uh, you can see from the, just the NASDAQ portion here that initially we're, we're looking at some, some, pretty, some pretty red numbers here. We definitely have a bias to the downside and then that's a theme that, theme that we're going to be seeing universally as we go down through our different sectors and groupings. Uh, couple of buys here we've got one in EA and also one in Amgen but those are the only ones uh, we're definitely seeing some downside indications here and some of these are also on pretty good volume a couple things to pay attention to if we're seeing CPS conditions that means things have already turned here they're not just uh, first day down but they're uh, in the midst of, uh, of a move so really focus on these for follow, follow throughs on the NASDAQ also take a look at the differential cells as well because these are things that haven't turned yet but are poised to do so tomorrow. Also, make sure you're aware of the volume bumps. And we've got uh, one VWAP deviation in Baidu, which is closing very, very sloppily. Uh, Sina is also flirting with a VWAP deviation. That's uh, more than 5% below the day's open. So definitely seeing some sloppy action in a lot of those names. And don't forget to keep an eye on uh, Soho as well. In the financial patch, definitely bias to the downside here. We've got a lot of camouflage sell signals and quite a few are also lined up with, with uh, differential sell signals as well. Got some volume bumps today. We've got one in Morgan Stanley and we also have one in Goldman Sachs. Keep in mind that the uh, Dow reconstitution will be at the end of this week. Moving on to the uh, energy names, also seeing weakness here. A couple of these names are, uh, are fairly weak. Valero, again, showing real good weakness, more than 2% more than below the day's open. The uh, refinery uh, stocks were all very, very weak um, for most of uh, the last five trading sessions. Moving on to the, to the market generals, the generals are showing uh, camouflage sell signals where they're up on the day. The Dow right now is up about 111 points, uh, but a lot of these stocks and even the Dow components are up on the day but below the day's open and many of these things are coming at range high or in the area of a retest of prior highs so these all should be reviewed because um, this could be an important candle on the chart going forward housing stocks uh, for the most part a little bit weak uh, not not as universally weak as the uh, broad market this morning out of the shoot they were definitely the you know the, the strongest sector and for the most part they're really uh, holding up the best out of all the sectors today. The transports though are, are really pretty weak and a lot of these are seeing pretty good volume. We've got good volume in UPS, volume bump in NSC and also FedEx and most of these have uh, downside signals associated with them. Commodity names for the, a little bit weak here. Now the commodities are kind of a mixed bag today. Oil is very very weak down about two dollars but gold and silver are up a little bit so we've got kind of a mixed bag here. We've got a volume bump in um, Mosaic, MOS, and we also have one in Potash. So these fertilizer type names are still definitely in play. Alright folks, as always, uh, thanks for listening. This has been Rich for TradeSite.